Greetings from going to ours. We have seen in the last few days the devastation that happened along the entire coast right from North Goa to South Goa. This is basically to do with the oil pollution that hit the coast. It was first noticed at Anjuna when the people went for Ganapati Visarjan. Thereafter they noticed at Velsau, Kansauli, Uttorda and in the entire coast. Now we know the entire coast is one of the main stays of tourism. Now what does it mean when we see these star balls? Now these star balls are nothing but the oil sludge or the crude oil may have been pumped out from the ship. The other thing could be there was a heavy leak in either a tank or two tanks and this has spilled into the sea. But one thing is very clear that the ship travelled all along the coast. What could be the effect of these tar balls? The tar balls hitting the shore and the oil film being somewhere along the uh, in the sea it could have definitely affected the marine biology the marine life fishing activity and the tourism activity what could the government would have done in this situation now we know there is this document a manual which is followed religiously across the world marpol it gives at annex one how the oil management has to be done on the ship sadly and surprisingly we see that the government of goa says they have written a letter to the home ministry in delhi that speaks very sadly about the environment minister and the environment ministry in goa instead they should have cut it is happening secondly they could have roped in the captain of ports these are people expert on foreign going vessels they could have guided the government in taking measures now writing letter to the center doesn't solve the problem it only exposes the inefficiency about the government in goa and the type of people occupying the ministerial seats damage has been done the minister of environment nilesh kabral says it may not have been an oil tanker it could have been a normal vessel it is like saying uh, it could be a first time murderer so not a problem he is not a seasoned murderer it is something like that such immature and stupid statements coming out from the environment minister is uncalled for i appeal to the government act now your statements of uh, these tar balls being collected and buried in the sand is again damaging the environment you have to think of scientific ways of getting rid of this particular pollution i hope wiser council prevails involve the experts and take action at the earliest thank you devbare guru